love fashion, I love groups, and I love anything international. And I worship and adore Mary Lou Luther, who is, you know, I think the founder of Fashion Group International. And I love Margaret, who works with them. And, you know, I love designers, I love fashion, I love any excuse to get together and wear a sparkle top. And I'm presenting an award today for um, accessory designer. For us, we are thrilled to be here because I think that they make an amazing job. And it was created by women, but very important women. So we are women and we do appreciate that. It's our pleasure to host the 16th annual Rising Star Awards to celebrate great talent in our industry. We were picked out of over a hundred, I believe, designers. Nine of us were finalists. So in a sense, we're all winners anyway. So I'm just gonna relax and have a good time. It is about that personal attention, that handmade, and FGI has that. So I'm very, you know, I'm honored that they treat me so well, again, being a newcomer. This season is a great crop of talent. It's actually an amazing lineup of finalists this year. So we're all very, very excited at Fashion Group. We're very proud of the event. We have an exciting group of finalists. They're committed, passionate, involved, and they're just delighted to be here. It's an institution made up of remarkable women that hold our profession so importantly and high. And there's great integrity here. It's not um, an organization that just has to do with fashion, but care. Know in your heart that in that you're sitting here, it's an award already. I'm trying to beautify this planet. It's a rigor and it's a dedication, de dedication that is nonstop. It becomes part of your bloodstream. I wish you all the best of luck. I kept it as brief as possible. And um, my love to you. Thank you. Hello, I'm Mr. Mickey. Since I'm doing accessories, I couldn't decide if I should bring my Stella McCartney handbag on stage with me, so I decided not to. And the winner is Cornelia Guest. When I walked into Bloomingdale's, and Francine Klein looked at me, and I, I, I have no idea what she thought I was going to show her. And I brought out my bags, and she and her team, Brooke Jaffe, they taught me what an SLG is. And I'm the luckiest girl in the world. So thank you, everybody, for voting. And if I can just let people know that I don't think animals need to suffer for us. So if I can just spread that word with my line, that's what I really want to do. So everybody, thank you so much. The angels in my life, Mark and James, James Fallon, all of you keep me going and you help me every step of the way. So thank you everybody so much. Uh, good afternoon. I'm so honored to be here this, um, this afternoon to present the Beauty Fragrance Corporate Rising Star Award. And the final Rising Star Award goes to Alana Hawawinen. I always knew that I would end up in a creative field, but I landed in beauty, in the beauty industry by chance. I'm extremely passionate about developing products, and I'm fortunate to come to work every day and do what I love. I'm even more privileged to be able to practice my profession in a company that truly fosters creativity and innovation. Working for Estee Lauder companies and the Estee Lauder, Estee Lauder brand is a true honor. I've had the chance to meet both Mrs. Evelyn Lauder and Mr. Leonard Lauder, who were and are extremely passionate about development and creation of new products. So I'd like to thank my mentors who are here to support me today. Arlette Paolo, who gave me my first job in the industry, and those who I like to call the dream team, led by the incredibly talented Anne Carullo, Jennifer Palmer, Joyce Kasuf, who's my daily mentor and friend. So thank you very much. Um, at El Decor, we like to think of ourselves as the fashion magazine for the home, and we're always looking for rising stars, so I'm very, very happy to be here today and be part of this wonderful Fashion Group International event. And I'm happy to say that the award goes to Gustavo Carmona Munoz for Materia Architectonica. To um, my team, who's so passionate uh, and does it all for, for design and commit, very committed to that, and to God for allowing me the gift of uh, enjoying life through architecture. And um, the acceptance of an award for me is more the acceptance of a challenge. So we hope we're gonna stay up to the, uh, to the challenge. Thank you very much. And to Fashion Group Mexico too. Viva Mexico. Thank you. And the winner of the 
Entrepreneur Award goes to Carlos Huber of our uh, My three musketeers, R uh, Rodrigo Flores Ruv, Sophie Vensamun, Jan Vasnier, who helped this happen. You are my friends, my mentors, my teachers, and, uh, and of course my family, above everybody for making this hop possible, for giving me this wonderful opportunity in life, and, and, and to all of you. So I share this with all of you. Thank you so much. I'm thrilled to be here today with the only fashion organization that recognizes fine jewelry as a category unto itself. And now, the Rising Star Award goes to the designer of the Emeralds of My Dreams, Alexandra Moore. Every moment of your life is infinitely creative and the universe is endlessly bountiful. Just put forth a clear enough request and everything your heart desires must come to you. Randy and Milling and everybody who is an angel and everybody who, is not, who was not able to make it today, uh, this dream would not have been a reality without you. Margaret Hayes, um, Fashion Group team, Louise, thank you. Thank you all so much. <laughs> Good afternoon, and thank you, Margaret, for asking me to present this award. It's a really important one, the Rising Star Award for Retail. So, and now, the Rising Star Award for Retail goes to Haley Barna and Katya Beecham of Birchbox. Oh my gosh, my heart is pounding because we really didn't expect this. We were hanging out in the we back, were, not, <laughs> not expecting this at all. This is such an insane <laughs> honor to be in this group. We are very new to this world and this community. We really appreciate all the support that we've gotten on this journey, so thank you. Uh, as a publisher of GQ, this is a particular fun category for me. Um, and I'm really pleased to announce the four finalists for the Menswear Award. Um, and the Rising Star Award goes to Tim Coppins. So, unfortunately, Tim couldn't be here today, so he asked me to thank the people um, who supported and inspired him to launch the brand in his own name, and my own fabulous team, Julia and Johan, and the talented and inspiring people of the city of New York. You inspire me every day. Tim says thank you. Hi. Uh, first of all, what a beautiful event, and congratulations to all of the recipients uh, so far. Uh, Margaret, first of all, thank you so much, and to Fashion Group International. I don't know where you are, Margaret, but thank you. Um, we are so delighted to launch the Business Innovator Award this year. Megan and Mandy, it is my absolute pleasure to give you this award for Business Innovator, and we congratulate you on a well-deserved achievement. Thank you to the Fashion Group International, Margaret Hayes. Karen, you are such an inspiration to us. This is, we are dying. When we heard about this, there were major 80s dance moves going on in our office. <laughs> Thank you so, so much. Hi, it's such a pleasure to be here today. Um, we have nine finalists uh, for this uh, Women's Wear Award. Uh, I think it demonstrates the, the depth and wealth of talent we have in this room today. And so the Rising Star Award goes to... Oh, we have a tie. Norman Ambrose and Tia Tiabani. Firstly, I'd like to say thank you to FGI, to its members, for all those who voted. And uh, this award means a lot to me. It almost uh, represents acceptance, which, you know, is something that we all strive for. Thank you, FGI. Um, this is such a wonderful compliment. Congratulations to my fellow winner. And congratulations to um, all the nominees. Um, thank you, FGI and Margaret Hayes, for recognizing newness and nurturing it and to my lovely little team. Um, it's for all of us. Thank you.